Thanks for watching. I went to a big event where there was a lot of the top golfers in the world playing recently. And we've been talking a lot on the channel about lag tension and impact and how to get it and whether or not good players have it and really how they do it. So I think I uh, wanted to capture some things to really kind of illustrate this in a, in a very clear way. So if you see those lines on the ground there, this guy's the number two golfer in the world at the moment. Uh, he might be number one after this week. So uh, if you look at those lines on the ground there, the blue lines, I always put those lines at the back of the ball. And then the red line goes off of the front lever of the swing, which is usually just fr uh, from the elbow through the wrist and then continuing onwards. If you have a bent arm, it's a, a bent left arm, it's a little bit different. So going through some of these, of all these guys, 30 some golfers that were captured, uh, only one didn't have lag tension at impact. And uh, I think this was some kind of punch shot or specialty shot. There was no lag tension here, or maybe zero, something like that. But as we go through these, you'll see all the other swings ha had it. Some had a little, some had a lot, but you can see that red line pointed at the ground and might see it a little bit better in this video. I, I like this video even better because it really shows uh, clearly. Some had a little, some had a lot, but they were all in, in that kind of blue zone. And the more they had, the, the, the further up I put them. So, and then these are drivers, and then with driver, same thing. Some had a little, some had an absolute ton. They get this, this here, this is the guy who won had just a ton. And if we go back to, to this video, one of the things I noticed that, that was interesting is that it, it's different because some players had a certain amount with driver and then had a totally different amount with irons. So, and we go to the driver, so this is a rookie of the year, last year, I think, amazing. Uh, see, it's not a ton of lag tension, but he has it. I mean, it's actually, that actually is quite a lot. This is the guy who won this tournament. That is just a ton. This is uh, a guy who is um, like pound for pound, the best driver of the golf ball in the world. So I asked my friend Bill Knodel. So this is the Windstar Golf Academy. We are having the Be Better Golf School at the Windstar Golf Academy. It's a really amazing facility. They have a track man, a sand putt lab all this other awesome equipment. One of the things they have is this Gears Golf system that tracks like so many different points on the body really exactly in 3D space. Tony Lutzak will be at the school and also at the school will be the lead instructor of the Windstar Golf Academy, Bill Knodel, who you see on the channel a little bit. So I asked Bill to send me uh, like a bunch of amateur swings. Like they didn't have to like, just give me the first 10 or so that are on your computer, amateur swings. So we saw, so the, these actually, the first thing he sent me were some pro swings. So this guy actually was the guy in all white that was in that video before. This is a super famous pro. Uh, he's an Ameri American, like really uh, is one, I think five times. This guy's won four or five times, real young player, amazing player. Uh, this is a really good player. He's been good for a long time. So we can, and so you can all see, see that yellow line, that, that yellow line actually is an extension off, like as if there was a rod sticking out of the back of the club and you can see how it's out, out past their shoulder. So now we go to, I put the same line that I put on these golfers, see coming off their left forearm that then points at that blue zone. I put that same line on some amateurs. See how that blue line is nowhere close to what you would call to those blue lines, which you, you know, I would call that the, the lag tension zone. Go to the next, next guy. So same thing here. So both things, we can see that yellow line that continues the butt of the shaft is through their body. But th this line, which shows if they have lag tension or not, is like they're not close at all. And I put, I, I put them in the same order where now we're getting to see they're getting close, but even a guy like this that's getting pretty close, 
he's still going to be in the casino, so to speak, as far as he, once the club passes that red line, which is an extension of your, like the lead fulcrum, basically, of the swing, you're not controlling, you're not in control very much at all. Now, he's getting a lot closer, but he's still going to be minus one or, or maybe even a little less of a uh, lag tension and impact. This guy would have basically zero. So this guy would be minus one, and this guy would be zero. He's not doing too badly at all. This guy, uh, we're back again the other way. This is, this is not good. This is going to be out of control. And then this guy is uh, a little less than zero. This guy is uh, kind of hard to tell because of the way that sh shaft is deformed some, some way, but maybe, maybe has a little, but a little awkward looking. Now, this was an amateur that actually had some, and I don't know, I'd have to ask Bill the level of this guy's play, but that is, that is really great. That's like, some of the, uh, that's like some of those first images we saw. You can see the huge differences of, the, of all these guys who were, this, is, this was on a Sunday, so they're all guys who were playing really well in this tournament. They all had lag tension and impact. And going over to these amateurs, almost none of them have, had it. We're gonna to start to get a lot more into how to do it. So beyond like, okay, like that is something you want for sure. And it's not really so much about shaft lean at all. If we go to these drivers, you can see that shaft there is basically, I mean, that's just leaning forward just a little bit. It's not much shaft lean, but it's a ton of lag tension. Look how much that, you, that would be like a plus nine lag tension or something for just, for that guy. And for this guy who won the tournament, that's like plus eight. And you can see the shaft is not really leaning forward very much, but it sure has a lot of lag tension. That's what we want to try to get. So hit the subscribe button and we're going to get a lot more into the how to do that. And uh, come join us at the Windstar Golf Academy in Thackerville, Oklahoma, just one hour north of Dallas. And we're going to go through some really specific technology that can help you do this and also some some drills and other things that are really going to improve your impact we're going to have a lot of fun there's 27 holes of golf there and a lot of other things there's a full video about this in the description to this video that you can check out or just go over to go over to bebettergolf.net slash school and you can see information thanks everybody see you there bye